welcome to day nine of the Get Productive Challenge. And hopefully you're gaining some momentum in this course. Remember, module one was all about getting organized, and hopefully you've taken those steps to think through uh, the goals that you want to reach. But today I want to challenge you to go beyond just setting goals and really challenge yourself to think about the actual direction you're heading in life. Remember, we're talking about getting the mindset, and we've been sharing some laws and principles that are all about productivity and accomplishing goals and leading yourself. But today I want to share with you and kind of challenge you with something that has been very impactful in my own life. And it's simply called The Principle of the Path. There's actually a book written by Andy Stanley. I would encourage you to read. But to sum it up in a quote that he put in the book, it's your direction, not intentions, determine your de destination in life. So we don't just show up at a destination without actually thinking about the direction and taking the steps necessary to get there. It's an important principle for you to understand. It could also be said this way. The sum of your life right now can be summed up by your own choices in life. In other words, take your health. You can go back in the past and look at choices and decisions that you made along the way that really sum up your actual health right now. I mean, that's just one example. But we could apply this in many different areas of our life. And it's important that you understand the difference between having the best intentions in life and actually taking directions and taking steps and developing routines and habits to actually get somewhere in life. I mean, you could, you could have all the greatest intentions in life ab about being productive, writing a book, getting in shape. You can read all the great books. You can read or listen to... Uh, fantastic videos, you can get inspired, but if you do not take daily steps or develop some simple life habits to get you going in the actual direction you want to go, it doesn't really matter about your intentions. You know, Andy Stanley used a great illustration, and that's if you lived in Atlanta and you wanted to go to Florida on vacation, and let's say you made all the preparations necessary you fill up the gas tank in your car, you check the tire pressure levels, you um, got an alignment for your car, you made sure that you bought anything that you wanted to use, a new surfboard, boogie boards, suntan lotion, you bought the best GPS possible. But then if you got in your car and when you had a choice to jump on the highway, you chose to go north instead of south, then it doesn't really matter how much great stuff you have or the GPS that you have. If you're not paying attention to it, all those great intentions of wanting to go to Florida, it's not going to really matter because your direction, the actual direction you're facing, isn't going to get you there. And so that's what happens to us in life. And my challenge for you is simple. Evaluate your actual direction, the actual habits, the routines, what you're doing in your life, and see what destination it's moving you towards. And make sure that you're not relying on just having good intentions. But ultimately, our habits, our routines, what we do every single day, the actual direction we're taking, is what's going to determine where we end up. So that's my challenge for you. I hope you get it. And get ready as we jump into setting up our systems to be more productive in the days ahead.